Hey guys, this is Ashmit and I'm back with the video and my Moto G 2014 just received the lollipop update, the official lollipop update as you can see here, the buttons have changed but I'll go and show you that this is Android lollipop 5.0 so yes, this is the official update and you can see little flappy bird game I'm not, I'm not very good with it. with it so yes I'm here to tell you all the changes and what you can expect from your update and should you update it or not uh, as you can see in the left hand side we have the Google Now icon and I think we can close it down I don't know about that all the changes if we see first of all the dialer has changed a little bit you can see there is a animation I don't know if you can see that in the video but there is yes there is yes there are some changes the way it looks uh, the contacts have also changed a little bit the icons have rounded up and this and this thing oh god this thing feels like liquid when you when you're in the end and you're trying to pull the upward things that is very good uh, next is the notification center if you pull it down once you see all the notification I don't have any I don't have any but if you now pull it all the way down again you see all the toggles Wi-Fi Bluetooth your dual sim connectivity airplane mode torch now you can activate your torch right from there location services cast screen uh, if you go here on the right corner, top corner, you can see your guest modes. And yes, this is going to give you options to add new guests, uh, friend or anybody else. This is my mother's phone. So yeah, uh, you can see all the cards. This is the new uh, multi-screen. The other things I have changed uh, which are... The first of all the keyboard has changed uh, let me go and type a new one this is the new keyboard the predicted one I hope so yeah that looks pretty good pretty dope hi my name is Ashmeet yeah that should that is working beautifully as you can see hi my name is Ashmeet so yeah that is that uh, the other things that have changed is the clock has changed a little bit it used to be black now it's as you can see it's purple uh, the functionality is almost same but the looks have changed a little bit that's it uh, settings have changed uh, if you see this settings settings have changed a little bit nothing major but yeah it's all new look and feel is very new and the most important thing I have to say that it is running beautifully on my Moto G I wasn't expecting it to run like this but as you can see in the multitasking a lot of thing is running in the background but still fluid very very fluid so I'm impressed with that uh, one more thing I have to show is the camera app uh, it is it is, exactly, it is exactly the same yeah it is exactly the same uh, Chrome now with Chrome's all the tabs for example if I go to uh, this website uh, if it will be shown in the itself in uh, in the uh, notification multitasking tray it is going to be shown and you can swipe it to cancel it as as like that uh, yeah yeah so yeah that's it those are some changes which I think you would like in your new Moto G if you have uh, let me know in the comments how you uh, did you get the lollipop update or not I just received it right now in India so if you are in India go and check in your uh, settings let me show you about phone system updates go and select that 
and you should uh, if there is a uh, availability of update you're going to see that it will say software update uh, it is uh, android 5.0.2 as you can see so yeah that's the latest version so I'm impressed with that the everything is fluid runs perfectly as it's supposed to so yeah that's it guys thanks for watching it was a quick video to just show you how the new Moto G is after the update on Mo uh, on Lollipop yeah that's about it uh, thank you very much for watching the video if you like the video give it a thumbs up if you didn't like that give it a thumbs down subscribe for more videos in the future thank you peace ciao